Uh, hello, chess students. Uh, this is a chess lesson. Uh, with, with this video is dedicated to advanced players, and in this video I will learn you uh, how to play against uh, King's Indian with White. I will show you Fianchetto variation in King's Indian. I'm international grandmaster and I have a great experience uh, how to play King's Indian with White. Uh, I played this line. Okay, we'll show you the line. <laughs> First of all, G3. Uh, I, I played this uh, line for uh, more than 20 years old. Uh, more, more than 20 years. I have an experience. I won a lot of uh, games in this line. Okay, so this is Fianchetto variation. This is a very solid system. And okay, and this is a main position of Fianchetto variation. And in this position, uh black has a choice so there is a this is an important branch uh, so but i think that the most uh, popular and the most principal is knight b to d7 and the second is knight to c6 also there is c6 option and uh, c5 but uh, usually c6 uh, is uh, transposed into knight b to d7 line and to speak about c5 uh, first of all uh, i will recommend you the d5 and here uh, white uh, white uh, has to be ready uh, to face uh, bianco gambit b5 move and e6, so modern Benoni Fianchetto variation. All this stuff I will cover in the uh, future videos. Okay, but this video, a few words about knight b to d7. Here the main plan for white is just to play e4. And then very important uh, to occupy this square with this uh, duck square bishop. Uh, okay, but after rook e8, uh, bishop e3 is playable option, and it was played many times, uh, uh, many many years ago by old uh, Soviet masters. But in this video, I will uh, my recommendation is to start with h3. This is a very very useful prophylaxis. Uh, the idea is to prevent knight to g4 threat. Okay, and uh, so what what to do? So h3 and usually knight pd7, this uh, rook e1. I think that the main um, the character of the position and the strategy uh, black's plan is to prevent bishop e3 and white's idea is just to develop the bishop on e3 um okay but let me show you the basic and very instructive uh, game which was played between uh Chukilt, between tigran petrasian white pieces and uh, victor chokilt romanian uh, master it was played many many years ago but this game is very instructive so i will show you briefly um this what was played in this game so um Queen to c2, uh, queen to e7. So now very important that uh, after rook a to d1, there is no knight to e4, knight to e4, take. Yeah, because of. So this, this pawn is poison and. Uh, uh, I because now there, there is bishop d2 and. Queen C2 is impossible because of rook eight, and in case of this, we take take and then take, and then bishop to h6, and black has to resign. This is a very important uh, trap uh, in this setup. Before uh, before uh, studying this system for white, you you have to know this uh, trap. Okay, but also. 
got the idea in the middle game. For example, this, this, f3, I don't know, a4, bishop, f2. And the main idea here for white is uh, to play f4, then to play b4. Uh, for example, the position like, uh, I don't know. Something like this. This is a, a dreaming position for white. Uh, white has a big positional advantage, uh, so huge space advantage here. And this is what we aim uh, when we when we play fianchetto variation for white. Okay, next videos uh, I will cover more uh, briefly this uh, topic. I will show you some uh, very instructive games how to play this with white. So what else? Also c6 and also very good option for black is just to take on d4 and then just uh, to attack this pawn or mm, to go for this uh, plan a6 b5. So. The plan with uh, uh, with c5 b5. Okay, let me show you the black's idea, which is uh, behind of this a6 move, rook e1, rook b8. And now, in case of bishop e3, there is knight to e5, b3, and c5, knight c2, and now b5, with very complicated position. Uh, it seems that more uh, correct move is rook to b1. Uh, and now after knight e5, b3, c5, knight to c2, uh, b5, c takes, c a takes, a4. Now, very important that uh, in case of knight c6, there is e5, and this knight is hanging. And in case of knight p3, we can just simply take. And uh, why rook b1 is better than bishop e3? Because now the pawn is protected. And also, there is no rook on e1. This is very... Uh, dangerous uh, diagonal so uh what else what else um, Okay, now a few words about knight c5 idea. Rook e1 and d5. This is a old, old line, uh, old plan. Uh, Black's Black's idea is just to play c6, a4, queen to a5. It was played in the game of Mikhail Batvinik and Efim Geller. Uh, and I like here knight b5. This is a very important option for white. Uh, White's idea is to prevent c6. This is very, very unpleasant. So, um, what else? And yeah, but for black, the strongest one of the strongest continuation is and more tricky move is bishop to d7. Uh, the idea that now before is not um, dangerous for black because so um, this uh, pawn structure uh, is a little bit uh, vulnerable, and um, for instance, uh, there is some ideas like. Uh, Take, take, and then uh, this move. Queen c8, and this pawn c4, this bishop. Okay, I don't like this for white. And my recommendation is to play rook b1. Uh, uh, very good in this position is waiting strategy. King to h2, uh, b3, then... Okay, and... So, uh, finally, the main idea, of course, is just to play f3 and bishop e3. And to do this... Uh, Bishop e3, bishop f2. So to do this plan, which was played in the previous, uh, which was uh, in the previous uh, annotation, which was my recommendation. So okay, and uh, now a few words about at the end of the video. Of course, a few words about knight to c6. Uh, here, very interesting option is d5. Uh, 
I played this uh, line for, for many times. This is very interesting. Now the idea is not to be on hard with knight c3 and to play a3. Uh, very interesting line. But it is um, a little bit unpleasant for white is c6. I think c6 is stronger and more tricky move. Now I like knight a3. I like this move. Uh, the, the, the idea that in case of knight c3, there is c takes d5, c takes d5 and e6. And after this, this, uh, we see that this knight on c3 is not uh, good. And in case of knight e3, so very good that this knight on e3 and we stop this knight c4. We just can take. So uh, here in this setup, it is better to uh, have this knight uh, on a3 than on c3. <laughs> very very strange but okay it's uh, so now a3 but black has c5 uh, then knight c2 and this is a very complicated position i will cover this uh, more deeply in the following videos so now a few words about uh, yeah but okay but what about knight c3 is the most uh, popular moves now black has two options a6 and bishop to a5 Against bishop to f5, very interesting is a new idea which was played a few times in the correspondence uh, chess. Yeah, knight h4, very important. Now this doesn't work because of this, this, and queen to d3, double attack. And uh, in case of uh, bishop d7, b3, c5, bishop to b2, yeah, very important. And now queen to d2. And now the point that after this knight to d1, and after this very strong move bishop c3. And after this we can just simply take, so the knight is hanging, so uh, black has to go back. And after b takes c4 we have a big positional advantage. Um, then e4, then knight e3, e4 and very comfortable position for white. Okay, and what about a6? And against a6, um, I also had a big experience. Uh, I had a lot of games with this stuff, uh, very interesting stuff. But I think that, uh, okay, in case of knight h5, I like white's position. But in case of this, I don't like this position. I, I don't like this position. I cannot. Uh, okay, this is this is also playable, of course. But sorry. Okay, we can discuss this more deeply in the few following videos. So, also very interesting option for white is e three. After this queen to e2, very interesting line, and very, very, very poisonous for 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 black. Um, what else? Uh, here you have to know that um, the logical queen c2. So you have to know, of course, b3 doesn't work because of this knight is hanging, and after this. Okay, the, we take the rook, or uh, in case of c takes d4, this knight is uh, under attack. So for this reason, we have to protect. But now, very strong idea is to sacrifice this pawn. For this reason, e4 is the strongest continuation. Also, uh, very interesting line for white. Uh, it could be recommended. Mm. What else? Uh, Yeah, also very important here, you have to know that e4, I don't like this move because of after bishop g4, this this uh, square is weak and white has a, uh, black has a very good idea to occupy this square.
So, okay. Oh, tu, 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 tu. Okay, so. Uh, I will show all this. I will cover all these interesting moments in the future videos. But okay, but uh, I want to ask you to subscribe for the channel. Um, to ask about my videos. Other uh, chess amateurs.